What up, ya boy shitty microphone historian here, and today we're gonna check out Update 7, which is the first early access release of this game. And we're gonna play Search and Extract. This mission is basically what Egg Hunt is now, but with more kite and no terrain scanner markers. It was actually still in the game when I bought it, and was my second favorite mission type, but that was like a year ago. I don't know if I will still enjoy it as much as I did, but we'll see. I want to quickly mention this old egg hunt here. It used to be exactly the same as Mining Expedition, except all the Morkite is replaced with eggs. Also, uh, here's like the old upgrades and stuff. I did try putting my old save file in here, hoping that it transfers everything, but all it did was raise my player rank. As you can see, I'm 26. Even though all my classes are level 1. I also have all the credits, I just don't have any of the materials. So it's, that's a little annoying. So I can only get a few upgrades. You also notice the shield is like plus 10 and poison resistance here is 100%. Obviously that was changed by now. You used to have be able to have 50 shield and... I'll play engineer this time, because he's my favorite class. How about that lightning round now? Gravity recalibration is missing. Upgrade terminal UI is older. Accessory terminal UI is older. Also has old armor. Change looks terminal UI is older. Key performance monitor is missing. Information channel appearance is outdated. Memorial hall is exactly the same. Mission icons are diamond shaped. The mission terminal model is old. The map itself is old. Terrain scanner breaks whenever you dig while it's out. Elevator plant is using a placeholder model. Pudo shell isn't removed yet. Gunner is carrying the C4. And, uh, um, and like always, various other things, especially old weapon models. Now, let's start the mission. You'll notice that the biome will not be radioactive exclusion zone. And. Oh my. <laughs> Maybe it is a little. Maybe there, there is a bigger difference than I anticipated. It just looks different. It's not like it functions differently. I think this was before Mokteras, even. This is how old this is. There's no Mokteras yet. Only have, like, spiders. Oh yeah. Look at that grenade launcher model. That's fucking beautiful. <laughs> He's holding it with one arm. That's gorgeous. Oh my god. So the main problem with search and extract used to be is that you could easily get lost. Like you'll mine Morkite and then you'll be like, okay, where's this last piece of Morkite? I have no idea where to look for it. You know? That was the main problem with this mission type. But I secretly enjoyed that. I secretly enjoyed being a little lost and having to look for the Morkite for longer than usual. Because it actually made it feel like it's a weird fucking cave you just went in. Like you have no idea where to go or what this cave even is. And you just have to look for the minerals. It made it feel like... What are those sounds? It doesn't have any sounds. Oh no, I'm fucked. Bosco can't see. Wait, what? What? What's happening? Hello? Okay. Why did it make like fucking bat sounds? Did you hear that? Um, how about I recall the sentries for once? Because you can build them pretty fast in here. I might as well take advantage of that. I don't. What the fuck? What? <laughs> okay. I don't know. I don't know. This is why I, why I love these versions, okay? Oh, right! I forgot to utilize this in the previous version, but... Hey! We have Q-mining. Time for a brief history lesson. I'm aware that not everyone knows what Q-mining is. It was an exploit that allowed you to both attack and mine faster by switching your weapon and then immediately using your pickaxe again. Here's a small demonstration of how it compares. Now the funny thing is, some of the developers were known to actually like this exploit, but seemingly as it isn't in the game anymore, they ultimately decided to remove it. Don't take my word for it, but I believe they gave us that super pickaxe attack to make up for the exploit's removal, 
But again, I didn't talk to the developers about it, so I'm likely wrong. That new attack does give the pickaxe much more significance in battle, but we permanently lost the ability to mine stuff faster, which was the thing that I mostly used it for. Also, it feels like there were just as many people that liked it and hated it in the community. So the general opinion kind of ended up as a mixed bag. Some people were suggesting to transform it into a feature to make mining a little more interesting, but um, let's not get into that. But oh come on! He's also in a side of crystal or some shit. The fuck is up with them going inside crystals? Oh, dude, I'm so glad we have too many platforms now because that's pretty handy. <laughs> uh. Okay, 19. That should be enough for the. Oh, there's like dirt here. Oh boy. It's one of those, isn't it? No, it's kinda not that far. Oh boy. Oh boy. Here we go. <laughs> come on, come on. Where's the cave? Where's the cave? It's right there. Oh! No, 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 Oh! Motherfucker! Goddamn body blocked me, like it's Half-Life 1. I'm stuck. There's not like any console I can bring up. Oh, great. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Oh, god damn it. Wow. Just wow. Okay, I attempt to because I decided to trap myself like a dumbass. Okay, where the fuck did you come from? <laughs> that, that was funny. Bosco, fuck off! Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. Come on, turn around. Show me that butt, show me that butt. Yeah! Get out of here, get out of my face. No 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 Okay, so now I have to get my bearings. Where was I? Oh I wasn't here because this is still unmined. Now now let's look for more more kite, more more, more more kite, more more kite, more more kite. Just drop a regular grenade in there. Yeah, boy. Where's the big ass? Oh, there's the big ass boy. Oh, ho, ho, you're toast, buddy. You're toast. Yeah. That's what happens. That's what happens. Oh, hello. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> that's fair. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> oh, that was just funny. Yep. At least you're not on the ceiling. Oh my god, are you serious? It was still... Where is he? Get rid of him. He's a ammo sink. Trust me when I say he's an ammo sink. 
You'd think maybe in the older versions it was even easier to kill. No, 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 no. He doesn't have a weak weak point. I'm gonna show you right now if he doesn't kill me. He has no weak point. And Bosco killed him. Okay. Okay, let's finish this mission. Yep, I agree. I agree. Went a lot smoother in the first attempt. <laughs> We have a, a bunch of crafting resources. It's nice. Oh, are you waiting for me to set this up? You're such a polite little glyph that now you can die. And we're done. Hell yeah. That's search and extract! My second favorite mission type, or it used to be. That's it for this video. Would I say that search and extract is still my second favorite? Honestly, it's hard to say. The latest version has a ton of different balance changes and twice the guns. I'll go on a limb and say I would still enjoy it as much, if not more. But at the same time, I would definitely understand people hating on it. You are bound to take forever in finding the last bit of Morkite sooner or later. So I guess it's still my second favorite mission type, at least in the older versions. But in the latest ones, at the moment my second favorite is... Salvage Operation.